Now we've done something totally new to El Capitan, and it's the ability to work really easily on two windows side by side. So I'm just gonna click and hold here on the green button, and you see it's prompting me to pick a side. I'll just drop it in, and you notice I get an expose of all my other windows. Let me pick the new news app, just like that. Of course, I can resize this window to style it just the way I want. How about that blur? Again, innovation. How about that blur? Again, innovation. This might look familiar to some of you. Here I can move to the edge, and you'll see the snap preview where PowerPoint's going to go right on the edge of the window. And I'll let go, and voila, I've snapped PowerPoint on the edge of a multiple uh, display. And you notice I get an expose of all my other windows. Let me pick the new news app. Now I can put Word over here. I can grab my photos, and I'm going to snap them. Watch carefully on the edge. I'm going to snap them right here, and then I'm going to choose being up here. And this might look familiar to some of you. Snap two windows into place, and each one fills half the screen, so you can compare them side by side. Welcome to Windows 7. So now, with just a single finger swipe from the side, I can slide it right in with what we call slide over. And of course, it's fully interactive right here. I can take a look, maybe type a response, put it right back. I'm back in Safari. You do that again. Now from the top, I can pull down and bring in other applications. So let's bring in Calendar. Of course, fully interactive, so I can tap into another day. Let's bring in another app. I'm going to bring in the new Notes app, just like that. Now, sometimes, of course, I want to stay working in Notes and Safari, both at the same time. So I can just tap here on the divider, and now I'm in split view. They're both completely active. In fact, for the first time ever, multi-app, multi-touch. I can move them both at the same time. I can move them both at the same time. Again, innovation. This might look familiar to some of you. Again, innovation. For the first time ever, multi-app, multi-touch. I can move them both at the same time. The split, so let me just move that over to a nice 50-50 view with notes and Safari. This might look familiar to some of you. Move the divider between the apps to resize them. You can also open the second app from your list of recently used apps. Tap or click the left or right side to replace one of the apps. On some screens, open and drag it until the space appears. If you want to change the order of the apps on the screen, drag one of them down to the middle of the screen and then place it where you want. is they just have no taste. They have absolutely no taste. And, and, and what that means is, I don't mean that in a small way, I mean that in a big way, in the sense that they, they don't think of original ideas and they don't bring much culture into their product. They would never have that in their products. Um, and so I, I guess I have a problem with the fact that they just make really third-rate products. Their products have no spirit to them. Their products have no spirit of enlightenment about them. They are very pedestrian. The sad part is, is that most customers don't have a lot of that spirit either. Products don't display more insight and, and more creativity.